Alfred. Oh, thank God. When the explosion... I thought you might be... It's okay, Alfred. I managed to reduce the blast radius and prevented the toxin from spreading into the city. But what about Scarecrow? Or this Arkham Knight character? They've got tanks, missiles. Their forces are all over Gotham. Crane got away. I was exposed to his toxin. Good Lord, are you all right? Remember what happened at the asylum? It's okay. I had a bad reaction. But it's over now. I've really got to hand it to Scarecrow. I've never been a fan of his concoctions up till now, but this batch, it's uh, <laughs> intoxicating. It really brings out the me in you. <laughs> Sir, did you hear what I said? Commissioner Gordon has been trying to contact you. Thanks, Alfred. Jim. You got out. See, I said you wouldn't let me down. I need to speak to you. Sure. What is it? Meet me outside GCPD prisoner detention. I'm heading there now. Wait to see the look on his face when you tell him his daughter's been kidnapped. <laughs> and it's all your fault. <laughs> this is going to be... I gotta go. Batman's here. What's wrong, Jim? Come on, you're scaring me. It's Barbara. She's been taken. No, no, no. I spoke to her. She said she got out. She left hours ago. Stay calm. We'll get her back. Which one? Who's got my little girl? Scarecrow. They took her from the clock tower. Hey, we need to go. There could be a clue. Something that will lead us to her. You've got to tell him it's your fault at some point, Bats. And the great thing is, I'll be standing right there when you do. Colleen? Is that you again? Candy Graham! Oh, don't pass out just yet. Come on. Show a little spy. <laughs> just wait till your father gets home. He's going to be furious about all this mess. like a trip down old memory lane, eh, Bats? And now a front row seat to the main event. You would have thought old Jim Gordon had been through enough. First, some handsome young maniac cripples his daughter. Now he's blaming himself for her being taken. You really should tell him this is your fault, Bats. I'm sure he'll understand. I mean, it's not like you went out and got his daughter killed. Well, not yet, anyway. The night's still young. Oh, God. No. This isn't your fault, Jim. Of course it is. Crane's done this to get to me. I should have been here. 
There's something I need to show you. We haven't got time. She's not like us. She's strong, Jim. Stronger than you realize. She works for you? This is all your fault. I will find her. She's my family! My daughter! She's all I've got! I never should have trusted you. Never! I'll do this on my own. Stay away from my family. I think that went quite well, considering. Of course, I wouldn't have told him, but that's why it's so liberating being me. You've got a lot to look forward to, Bats. I need to find out what happened to Barbara. They covered their tracks by disabling the clock tower security cameras. If I hack the municipal CCTV system, I should be able to monitor all access points to the building. They probably took her in one of those vehicles. I need to confirm which one so I can track it. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. I need to confirm which car he took her in. There. That's the vehicle they took Barbara away in. Those tires are Amertech D60s. I can program the Batmobile to track their unique tread pattern. It'll lead me right to them. Now that I think about it, how did Scarecrow know to go after your IT department? I mean, I had no idea she worked for you when I shot her. I just got lucky. Seriously, I was aiming for her head. Only had a video. The tire tracks will lead me to Barbara. I can use the Batmobile forensic scanner to follow them. Alfred, I want the Arkham Knight's name. As do I, Master Bruce. He has presumably chosen that title for a reason. Where do you suggest we start? Arkham City. Go through the files of every inmate who was released following the death of Hugo Strange. And Alfred. Yes, sir. They knew about Barbara. Activate the Batcave security protocols. Don't drop your guard. Think Arms looking for guys? I heard he's got a big... Alfred, the Arkham Knight's trail leads into Miyagani Island. Lower the Mercy Bridge. I, I can't, sir. We're locked out. The militia must have hardwired into the transport control system. Find me their access point. Right. Tracing the network traffic, it seems to have all been rerouted to Grand Avenue Station. Then that's where they'll be. I'll proceed on foot and take over their access point. I'll contact you when you're able to lower the bridge. Be careful, sir. Miyagani Island is rife with militia drones and troops. Listen up, man. We control the bridges, but that man can and will adapt. Stay alert. Watch the skies. The station's crawling with the Arkham Knights militia. I need to clear them out and find the access point they're using to hack into the transport network. I don't see any giant clouds. <laughs> With the 
Arkham Knight's men taken care of. I can use their uplink terminal to lower the bridges. Isn't that Barbara's job? Oh, right. In all the excitement, I almost forgot. <laughs> you don't really believe old Jimbo's gonna forgive you if you save her. He holds a garage bats. I should know. Alfred, I've re-enabled the bridge controls. Marvelous. I'm rebooting the network now. Forget it, Scarecrow. It's time to face your one true nemesis, Batman. Oh dear. Is that who I think it is? Enigma. Contact me when you're ready with the bridge. Riddle me this. Why would a Batman visit an abandoned orphanage? Eddie, sweetie, you confuse me with Robin. The big guy and I aren't all that close. Oh, oh, I know. It's because of what will happen to his feline friend if he doesn't get here in time. Batman? That had better be you. And you had better be sorry. Keep still. Are you okay? Perfect. What little girl doesn't dream of being bait for her strapping dark night? We're leaving. You might be, but I'm not. Ah! Both contestants are finally here. Tonight, folks, we've got riddles galore. But first, let me introduce my beautiful assistants. Ah, I'm growing tired of my dependence upon the least useless dregs I can scrape from Gotham's utterly uninspired underbelly. Why rely on others for help when you can design, program, engineer, and manufacture it yourself? A pair you made. Together, you're just competent enough to survive. Enjoy it while it lasts, Dark Knight. I have more in store for you than hitting things. No doubt you enjoyed that, Detective. It's the most fun you'll have all night. You see, Dark Knight, this feisty felonious feline has been fitted with a shiny new collar. With each challenge you complete, you'll get one little key. Collect every key and the kitty goes free. Remove it too soon and the kitty goes boom! <laughs> well, don't just stand there, Dark Knight. Take that rocket-fueled roadster of yours and make your way to the Cauldron Train Yard. My first test is waiting. Well then, detectives, it begins. You are staring, <clears throat> with stupefied incomprehension, at a mechanism I have calibrated to respond to an extremely precise radar pulse. In a moment, I will give you the decrypted code, Dark Knight. Oh, but first, I think we should run through the ground rules for tonight's festivity. <sighs> what? What? How did you... How, how did you... Solve tonight's very first riddle. <laughs> well done. Well done. Welcome to my racetrack, detective. You must complete three circuits of this gauntlet, finishing each before the time limit expires. Spires. Spires. Let's put that grotesque ego mobile to the test. Be ready, Dark Knight. There's more to this test than just going rum, rum, really fast. Tick tock, detective. Tick tock. Can that ramshackled motor handle this? Faster, Dark. 
dark night. Faster! Can those flickering, faltering synapses keep up with my automatically adjusting course? I'm disabling the afterburner's failsafe. I need the extra speed. I'm shocked, Dark Knight. Is that really as fast as it goes? Let's work that undeveloped brain of yours. Physics prohibit me from testing my non-Euclidean designs. Now then, detective, hop on the pressure pad beside me. Listen carefully, Dark Knight. Your friend's life depends on it. Back in the orphanage, a series of glass cabinets have appeared in front of Catwoman. Isn't that right, my dear? I see them, Eddie. Good. One of those cabinets, my dear, has your first key inside. The others? They contain less useful keys. Keys that will unlock the admittedly slight contents of your skull all over the orphanage walls. Your job, detective, is simple. Figure out which cabinet Catwoman must open. And don't get it wrong. You better be right, Batman. Head still attached? Great. Collar still attached? Not so great. Congratulations! You've achieved the very minor victory of not being as stupid as you look. Not stupid as you look. Now, Catwoman, celebrate your survival by telling Batman all about the exciting orphanage development. Celebrate the orphanage development. No, you do it. Now, Kitty. Kitty. Why, Batman, there's a big, mysterious green door. Yes, yes, there is. Come back to the orphanage, Batman, and I'll let the pair of you through it. Oh, good, you're back. Eddie wouldn't show me whatever deranged parlor game he's got waiting behind that door until you arrived. I'll get you out of here. I'm sorry, do I seem testy? It's probably something to do with the gorgeous necklace Eddie picked out for me. Have you seen it? It explodes. Oh, I do hope you two are getting along. You two. Because you'll need to work together if you want to find the key hidden in here. Find the key. Well, this looks creepy. Someone's been reading Feng Shui for serial killers. Oh, great. Extra trapped. As if the collar wasn't enough. Oh, Batman, Catwoman, Catwoman, neither of you is getting out of there without the other's help. Oh, look. It's more of Eddie's homemade friends. Well, there we go. It's settled. You're, you're, you're not quite as dumb as each other. Congratulations, Batman. Catwoman, you're lagging behind. Congratulations to the dementedly dressed duo. Your key awaits. Oh, but what's this? An electrified floor? Electrified floor? You do it. You still owe me for Arkham City. 
goodness. You figured it out already. <laughs> Meet the second generation of my Android allies. I've built a variant specifically tailored to each of your dubious abilities. Would you do the honors? <sighs> you know what the worst thing about this was? It looked cheap. Well, handsome, what are we waiting for? So is it just central Gotham that's evacuated? Or are the mansions empty too? Scarecrow threatened the entire city, Selina. And it's such a tragedy. You go save the day and I'll make sure Bruce Wayne locked his doors. Good luck with that. against your violent excesses. So please understand, Dark Knight, that this is an intellectual victory above all of all. Mm, which color do you prefer? Keep them coming. Thank you, Batman, for teaching me the effectiveness of violence tonight. You think me outwitted? Repent! Enough! This is beneath me! You are beneath me! You want to finish this, detective? Then you must earn the privilege! Solve every last riddle in this city and I'll fight you, Batman. But not a moment before. Or we could just leave you down there, Eddie. Come on, Batman. This cat wants to prowl. Ah, <sighs> fresh air, freedom, and darkness. Perfect. How shall we celebrate? I know a couple of poor, defenseless museums, but then again, I also know a couple of hotels. Tonight's not over yet. There's more work to be done. Of course there is. You do know how to kill the mood. <laughs> do you ever take the night off? Do you ever take the suit off? Not on nights like this, Selina. It's what I do. Fine. I guess I'll hit an art gallery or two while the big bad bat's distracted. You're not going to thank me? Why? It's what you do. Sir, I've regained control of the bridges. 
Good work. Alfred, I'm at the bridge. One moment, sir. I should probably warn you, there's a significant militia presence ahead. Duly noted. I managed to access the files Miss Gordon was working on before her abduction. It would seem she found a weakness in the drones, sir. A direct hit from the Vulcan gun on their sensor array should destroy them with a single shot. Sergeant, Mercy Bridge is being lowered. He's coming. Mama drones on his line in range with you. Tandem charge warhead. Designed to penetrate the toughest armor. I've got surprises too, Batman. The Arkham Knight's vehicle swerved and crashed up ahead. Car's empty. The Arkham Knight must have taken Oracle and moved on. I should examine the vehicle more closely. The car veered off an empty road. Looks like the driver wasn't wearing his seatbelt. Traces of pepper spray on the right side of the driver's face. Oracle must have been in the passenger seat and deliberately caused the crash. Clever. I should check the area where she was sitting. The door was torn off during the crash. Torn cleanly off the hinges. The door must have been opened before the crash. Oracle got out. Oracle stopped here. Someone took a shot at her. I should analyze the point of impact for ballistic evidence. The caliber of the weapon is a match for the Arkham Knight sidearm. The trajectory and impact velocity points to a shooter that matches his height. At this range, he couldn't have missed. A warning shot. I've missed something. Oracle knew she couldn't escape, but she caused this crash for a reason. She must have left a clue while crawling away. Lucius, Oracle left me the scrambler device at the scene of the crash. Decrypt the data so I can pinpoint the Arkham Knight's location. Ah, this kind of thing was more Miss Gordon's specialty. I'll see what I can do, but it'll take me a little while. I'll meet you at Wayne Tower when you're ready. of you to drop in, Mr. Wayne. I suppose you weren't really dressed for the front entrance. Have you finished the decryption? Fully decoded. I've downloaded all recent militia radio transmissions and their corresponding coordinates to your machine. Thanks, Lucius. I can scan the network for the Arkham Knight's voice print and determine the location of his last broadcast. Identity confirmed. Good evening, Mr. Wayne. Upload waveform for analysis. Now I've waited long enough. Batman dies. Tonight. 
night. Scanning communications for voice print match. Location verified. Got it. The night's transmitting from the Miyagani Tunnel Network. Glad to be of assistance, Mr. Wayne. While you're here, we've been working on some further upgrades for your car. Let me know where you'd like us to focus our efforts. An upgrade to your weapons generator will let you overcharge the Batmobile's secondary weapons. You'll be a force to be reckoned with. Excellent choice. I'll prepare it right away. Now if there's anything else you need, I'll be here all night. It's not like I could leave this city even if I wanted to. You know, if I'd ever been curious about your identity, I would have torn off that mask years ago. I always figured the truth would be a letdown. But I have to admit, masquerading as Gotham's least interesting socialite is one hell of a cover story. The dead parents are just icing on the cake. Take care, Mr. Wayne. You know where to find me. Alfred, I've traced the Arkham Knight to the Miyagani tunnel system. Excellent news, sir. But I'm detecting a significant drone presence in the area. It would be folly to engage them without the Batmobile. Noted. Shall I open the south entrance? Hold off until I get there, Alfred. I don't want to spoil the surprise. Accessing the building's security mainframe. Alfred, there's another blast door. I need you to open it. Oh dear. It seems they've locked me out of the system. They must know you're here. Don't worry, Alfred. I'll find another way in. Have you made any progress on the cure? Getting there. Hey, I haven't heard from Barbara for a while. Is she okay? She's fine. She's working on something for me. It's important. But she's safe, right? Don't worry, Tim. Just keep working on that cure. <laughs> oh, Bats! How very me of you! Though I can see why you didn't tell him after old Jimbo's hysterical overreaction. If you cared about Barbara the way that little sidekick of yours does, maybe she wouldn't have got kidnapped in the first place. So let's recap. Barbara's kidnapped, and let's face it, probably dead. You're lying to lover boy wonder about it, and dear old Jim's marched off on his lonesome to save the day. <laughs> Not your best day at the office, Bats. <laughs> Something on your mind?
You see these guys? Think they own Gotham. What are we going to do about it? Exactly where to shoot. <laughs> You're good, Dark Knight. Even better than I remember. It's gonna make it even more satisfying when I kill you. Oh, and don't worry about Barbara. I'll take better care of her than you ever did. Batman's in the control room. Show him what happens when he messes with mines. Who stop the Batman? No. Diamondback offline. Time to rescue Oracle and make the Arkham Knight pay. I see you back in the car, Master Bruce. I'm going after the Knight. He's here in the tunnel. Then let us hope he has Miss Gordon with him. night, but he'll know where I can find him. How does it feel to be chasing the wrong man? <laughs> where is 
the Arkham Knight. Ugh, you won't find him! You think I didn't know you were tracking my broadcast location? <laughs> Here's a lesson, Batman. I know how you think, which means I know how to beat you. Where is he? With Barbara Gordon. She's ours now. Can you imagine what the knight's going to do to her? What are you doing? No! You can't do this! Where is he? He's gone to see the little man, the penguin. <laughs> he supplied the safe houses for the attack. The knight's gone to pay him for his services. That's it! That's all I know! Remember something else? He uses a refrigeration company as a front. The trucks distribute weapons throughout the city. What's it called? North! North Refrigeration! Thank you. Alfred, I need you to find out everything you can about North Refrigeration. Of course. And may I inquire why? Penguin supplying arms to the Arkham Knight. And right now, he's the best lead we have to finding Barbara. I'll look into it right away, sir. Ah, I can see Mr. Fox is trying to contact you. Lucius. Mr. Wayne, your new Batmobile upgrade is ready to deploy. The Batwing is en route to Grand Avenue. around on rooftops you shouldn't have come here not tonight look are you kidding me when i heard about bar north refrigeration tell me what you know <sighs> penguins using freezer trucks to smuggle weapons out of bloodhaven now i think he's stockpiling arms right here in gotham the question is where cobblepot's the best lead we have on barbara i need to find that weapons cache if i can intercept one of his trucks it'll lead me right to him huh if only you knew someone who's been tracking their movements. What? You didn't really think I'd come here without a plan, did you? I'll handle this. You're needed back in Bloodhaven. Come on, Bruce. Look, let me help. You can't do it all on your own. It's too dangerous. I won't risk losing anyone else. Bloodhaven needs you. All right. I can take a hint. But if you want to keep tabs on that truck, you're going to need this. It's a prototype straight out of R&D. The old fox has outdone itself this time. I'll see you around, Bruce. I can disable enemy weapons using the disruptor sabotage ammo.
Let's see. A truck full of weapons and explosives. I can use the disruptor's tracker ammo to tag the vehicle and follow it across Gotham. Now I just need to give them a little motivation to lead me back to their hideout. What did you forget? No, no, no! It's Batman! Get the hell out of here! Subtlety works. Every time. If I stick to the rooftops, I'll be able to follow them right back to Penguin's weapons cache. Straight to Penguin's weapons cache. Like City in America. It's not that bad. Oh, come on, take another look. You see anything worth <laughs> The roof was heavily protected. This must be the way inside. Come on, do something. You're making me look stupid here. the other freaks to take the Ark of Night, Barbara Gordon. Tell me where they are. So that's who we had. The Commissioner's little girl. I'll break every bone in your body, Cobblepot. They were going to see some geezer called Simon Stag. I think he runs a pharmaceutical company or something. Do not lie to me. I'm not. I swear. He said he's about to leave Gotham. And those airships over the West River, it, it belonged to him. Put him down. Won't do you any good. Scarecrow's gonna break you. You are going down, Batman. Hold him steady, fellas. I've been working on my swing. Watch and learn. Gonna knock his head right. This is you handling it, right? I don't worry. You can thank me later. I'm gonna end you. Get ready. Let any of these weapons get onto the street. This cache needs to be destroyed. Bruce, you need to let me help. I had it under control. I told you, I need you back in Bloodhaven. Now, Scarecrow, these weapons, this all affects Bloodhaven too. The best place for me is here. Look, with the amount of weapons Penguin has been running into Gotham, this cannot be everything. He must have other caches in the city. Search this place for evidence. It should help us locate more of Penguin's refrigeration trucks. What a wanker. Let's put him out of business, eh? <laughs> Seriously? Do you believe that accent? Maddie only puts it on to sound scary. <laughs> What are you doing? Bats? Come on! Don't lock me in here. I'll do anything. You want your laundry done? I'll do it. Help out, Alfred. You got it. I wouldn't like to be that guy. I'm 
going after Barbara. I'll contact you as soon as I track down any of Penguin's trucks. Thanks, Dick. I appreciate it. Alfred, what do you have on Simon Stagg? Now, let's see. The CEO of Stagg Enterprises, a company that specializes in advanced medical research and development. I'm heading to Stagg's airships now. The Scarecrow was on his way there, and that's our only link to finding Barbara. I can see why you like it up here, Bats. Gives you time to ponder the really big questions, like is Oracle dead? Is it all my fault? Who's going to die next? <laughs> now let's get down there and find out. Soldiers are using an unmanned drone. If I can download the security codes from the soldier controlling the drone, I'll be able to turn it against them. I've got the codes. Now I can turn that drone against them. Knight and Scarecrow's forces have moved through this place, killing everyone. They must be there for a reason, sir. What are they planning? Barbara's the priority. When she's safe, I'll deal with them. But, sir, you have the chance to end this now. Capture Scarecrow, and you can save the whole city. It's what Miss Gordon would want. I'm not losing anyone else, Alfred. I should now have full rotational control of the airship stability system. Soldiers have got Stag, and from the look of him, he won't last much longer. I need to save him. Where are the files? I'm not telling you! You want us to cut off your fingers? I don't mind. We start with the fingers, and see how high we go before you tell us. Hey. We will!
thank you. They, they were going to kill me. Why? What did you do? Nothing. These animals came in and just started shooting. They were collecting those cylinders. Nimbus generators. A totally clean power cell technology we've been developing. Where's Scarecrow? He's on the second airship. Did he have anyone with him? Oh, you, you mean Barbara Gordon. I think we both know she's probably dead, don't we, Bats? <laughs> Stag's been taken to Scarecrow on the second airship. I've been analyzing the schematics, and it appears to be defended by automated gun turrets. There's a security terminal in the research laboratory towards the rear of your current vessel. You should be able to disable the turrets from there. Hmm. The weapon system controls are locked behind a scanner keyed to Stag's fingerprints. Without a clean set of his prints, I'm locked out. Maybe the CCTV camera feed can help me. I should scan the footage to see if Stagg's hands touched any surfaces during the abduction. I might be able to reconstruct the full set of prints. Stagg will have left a handprint on the floor there. I should check for other places he touched. There's more chance of getting a full set of prints. He touched the floor after he was thrown down the stairs. I should search for more prints. He touched that railing when he steadied himself. I should find more prints to reconstruct a full set. Stag left a handprint near the exit to the room. I know where Stag left his prints. Now I just have to scan those locations. I've got an index fingerprint here. Three locations left to scan. I've been able to reconstruct Stag's middle fingerprint. Two spots left to scan. I've completed reconstruction of Stag's thumbprint. One side left. I've got the full set. I should be able to access Stag's computer system now. So you're going to use a reconstruction of Staggy's handprint to access the computer. Oh, that's genius, Bats, really. Oh, I know. When you're done, let's hack his online dating profile. Mr. Stag. I can't remotely disable the turrets on the other airship, but I can control the turrets on this ship. That's the weapons dealt with. Scarecrow's next. Identification confirmed. Good evening, Mr. Sir, regarding the identity of this so-called Arkham Knight, 
What have you found? Nothing, sir. None of the former Arkham City inmates who remain unaccounted for fit the Knight's profile. Widen the search. When Joker took over the asylum, dozens of inmates escaped. Focus on young men with military experience. Downloading the files now, sir.